Dallas man says he feared for his life. And he should have. A stranger approached him on a local running trail, shot him multiple times. So he says the man shot him in his hip and in his shoulder, but he says the man was aiming for his head, and he spoke with Fox 4's David Centendry, who joins us now live. Quite a story to tell, David. Quite a story. This victim says this was supposed to be a normal morning exercise routine, but it turned into a random shooting. And I just said, oh, my God, and I started sprinting. A terrifyingly different type of run for Terrence Williams. Yeah, so I am a runner. I love to run. The 35-year-old says he was exercising on a trail in between Singing Hills and Glendale Parks in Oak Cliff on Monday, November 18th, when a stranger who asked him for directions on the trail the day before approached him again. And he looked at me and he said, this is going to be the last day that you see me. And it was confusing and I didn't know what it meant, so I just said, Okay, and I kept walking. He says it quickly turned even more bizarre. He kind of went behind the bushes, came out, went behind the bushes, came out again. And when he came out the second time, he had a mask pulled up over his face, covering half of his face with his hand in his left pocket. And that's when he was like really briskly approaching me. Approaching with a weapon. But then he pulled out the gun and I screamed and ran. Williams was shot in his right hip. And it wasn't even like I fell, I flew. I flew through the air and landed on the ground. And while lying, wounded on the ground, Williams thought his life was about to end. He got to me, he stood over me, he put the gun out over my face, it was pointed in my face, and I was just looking up at him, and he said, you're not dead, you're not dead, don't pretend to be dead, but you're going to be dead now. And like a headshot, just fired two shots. And I don't know if it was the grace of God who curved the bullets, my guardian angel. I don't know if it was bad aim. I don't know what it was, but he had that gun pointed at my head and one bullet hit my shoulder and the other bullet hit the pavement. Williams says the shooter left. With all my strength, crawled to my cell phone and dialed 911. Williams was taken to a hospital by Dallas Fire Rescue. Dallas Police Department says no arrests have been made. Was he watching me? Was he targeting me? Williams says he'll never forget the look of the gunman's eyes. They were just big and enraged and just angry, and his speech was kind of slurred and slow. For now, he's too scared to return home to his neighborhood. <sighs> and overwhelmed by the thought of being face to face with a gunman. I think that I'm still here for a reason. I think I still have a purpose. Williams says he's interviewed with detectives a few times. If you have any information about this shooting, you can obviously contact Dallas Police Department. For now, Heather, Steve, back to y'all.